Mali and Algeria are preparing to turn the page on a major diplomatic crisis that has disrupted decades of good relations between the two countries. The Algerian ambassador returned to Bamako on Friday, January 3, and his Malian counterpart is expected in Algiers. Qatar has been a mediator in the dispute between the two countries. According to Malian media, Doha has played a positive role in improving relations between Bamako and Algiers. The Malian foreign minister was received by the prime minister in Doha last week. Qatar's offer to Mali is for the development of bilateral relations and investment in the country. As a geopolitical ally of Algeria, Qatar has tried to ease tensions between the two countries by working for a rapid reconciliation. According to several experts, Qatar sees Algiers as a break on the Emirates' influence in the Sahel. The two Gulf states compete both economically and in terms of influence on the African continent. Shortly before this crisis with Mali erupted, Algeria accused the United Arab Emirates of allocating $15 million to Morocco to sow discord between it and the Sahel countries. Algiers was also eager to remind Bamako of its intangible attachment to Mali's territorial integrity, sovereignty and national unity, as well as to the peaceful voice that guarantees peace and reconciliation. Tensions rose when Algiers received Tuareg separatists and when Imam Diko visited Algeria. The Malian authorities say they were not invited, although Algiers says it was. Algiers wanted to give fresh impetus to the 2015 peace agreement, while the Malian authorities favor national ownership of the peace process and the establishment of an inter-Malian dialogue.